Let's start. Today we will see how to implement a recycler view swipe to refresh layout in the Kotlin Android. Let's see the project structure. At the app level build.gradle file, write this plugin. Then integrate the swipe to refresh dependency. Here we have the main activity, a model class, and an adapter class. And in this UI, we have the activity underscore main.xml file, which is the layout of the main activity. And the row underscore item.xml file, which is the layout of the single row of the recycler view. Let's see the UI. In the activity underscore main.xml file, the swipe to refresh layout is the root layout. Then, we have a recycler view inside a constraint layout. And in the row underscore item.xml file, we have a text view inside a constraint layout. Let's see the Kotlin code now. This is a model class with a string variable as the data member. This string will be shown in each row of the recycler view. These are the imports. This is the adapter class. These are the data members, and this is how we initialize them. In the onCreateViewHolder function, this is how we inflate the row underscore item.xml file. In the bindViewHolder function, this is how we get the data from the model class, and set it in the text view. In the getItemCount function, this is how we get the count of the number of items in the recycler view. This is the ViewHolder class. When an item in the recycler view is clicked, we show a toast here. These are the imports. This is the main activity. These are the data members. Here we have an array of string data, which we will use to populate the recycler view. In the onCreate function, first, we create an instance of the adapter class. Meanwhile, we call the getData function, which gives us the data that we will show in the recycler view. Then we set up the other attributes like animator, item decoration, etc. Finally we call the swipe to refresh function. This is the swipe to refresh function. Here we call the reset recycler view function. This is reset recycler view function. Here we shuffle the recycler view data and reset it. This is the get data function where we convert the data from array format to array list format. Let's run the app. So that's it. That's how you can implement a recycler view horizontal layout in Kotlin Android. Thank you.